All right, here's a picture of the beast. The beast on my back. You know, on my little trailer here, just a four by eight trailer, strapped down. Had to stop here because I'm somewhere in the middle of a nowhere Connecticut, or actually Rhode Island, I think. There's Reedy's Woodworking Shop, which is some cool stuff in the window. And here's a little micro shed playhouse kind of thing with a little loft for sale. Pretty cool. Let's see if it's open, probably not. Ah, oh, little loft up there. A couple little windows. Pretty cool. Actually, let me go in. Why not? Tongue and groove floor. Tiny little play loft up here. Have another storage play loft over here. Probably just a gardening shed, but perfect for kids. Very cool. And I'm, you know, I'm fairly dumb. I'm six foot four, so this thing probably has. Uh, Oh, it's a full chain light and everything. It's probably almost eight feet of headroom in here. And a wee little munchkin door. Gotta give the man a plug. Let's see if I can zoom in through here. Reedy's Woodworks, it says. We're like in North Situate, Rhode Island. A lot of cool stuff in the window. Carved Indians, uh, you know, furniture, that kind of stuff. Give a local artist some love. I guess it comes all wired. Just plug the thing in. They have some for sale sheets here. 1700 bucks. Two elevated beds with ladders, blah, blah, blah. It can be used as a chicken coop. It's actually not too bad. Oh, look at this. I love this. A little birdhouse built in the peak there. Now that's using your noggin. All right, onward with the journey. Here's the other side of my little structure all folded up. It's about twice as long once it's set up. Reedy's a man after my own heart, apparently. He turned half of his beat-up parking lot into a vegetable garden. Now that's Yankee ingenuity. Clearly his own boss. 